all systems green on the cryogenic top-off. Copy. We are sealed and secure. Main systems green. Initiating final checklist. Liftoff confirmed. We are go for climb. Max Q passed. Vehicle stable. Orbital burn complete. Preparing nav solution for interstellar jump. Life support optimal. Radiation shields holding. Course stable. Crossing Kuiper Belt Boundary. Long Range Systems Nominal. Cycle complete. Navigation adjusted. Orbital capture in 12 minutes. Engines primed for braking maneuver. Stabilizing orbit. Surface mapping begins in 60 seconds. Orbital decay confirmed. Final descent begins. Altitude 38,000 meters. Descent vector stable. Surface contact achieved. Systems green. Surface feels stable. Minor dust layer over rock plate. Radiation low. Composition shows sulfates and silicates. Temperature cycle holding. Begin spectrograph scan. Anchor set. Sensor active. Signal at 95%. We've got movement. Checking epicenter now. Caution. Planetary instability detected. Do not proceed beyond safe zone. Returning to bay for recharge and log entry. Seal confirmed. Data offload beginning. Rover system active. Battery level full. Route initialized. Structure ahead. Possibly volcanic in origin. Wind resonance patterns logged. No movement detected inside crevices. Iron alloy. Initiate return to rover. Maintain line of sight. Resuming course. Readings indicate shallow aquifer below 12 meters. Sample recovered. Density confirms saturated layer. Satellite confirms these aren't wind formed. Logging coordinates for future orbital survey. Rover dock complete. Offloading samples now. Systems nominal. Spectral breakdown in progress. Visual layers stable. Pathfinder drone launch approved. Terrain mapping queued. Drone telemetry online. Signal lock confirmed. These formations are pre-glacial. Looks ancient. Power core stable. Relay standing by for signal injection. Battery transfer complete. External systems on trickle reserve. All systems prepared for rest cycle. Log 03 Thram. Hydration stable, mental state calm. Awaiting next window.
Sensor clear. Drive systems nominal. Ready for field path 02. Initiating route east to subglacial anomaly. ETA 46 minutes. No structural instability. Marking formation as exofluvial. Thermal gradient increasing below 1.2 meters. This isn't ambient drift. Could be tidal linked subsurface flow. No pressure spike. Possible vent. No movement or life forms detected. Fissure logged as non hostile vent. Temperature above freezing near opening. No entry attempted. Positioning for shelter. Battery draw minimal. Awaiting light stabilization. Station active. Logging metrics every 10 seconds. Visibility at 12%. Instruments remain responsive. Log 05, fatigue manageable, environmental strain low. Next cycle, trench core sample. End of field cycle. Entering passive mode. Good data this round. Panel output back to 92%. Proceeding with core drill alignment. Anchor secure. Depth target, 3.4 meters, layered melt signature expected. Core temperature dropping. Sample nearing equilibrium. Sample lock engaged. Beginning spectrometry pass. Possible liquid reservoir. Depth at 140 meters. Mapping route overlay now. Sled calibrated. Scanning live, no compression gaps so far. Resistance confirms mass. Elemental scan returning now. Uplink confirmed. Full sync with Earth relay achieved. Structure secure. External pressure seals intact. We prioritize zone Delta-7 next. Terrain slope within safe parameters. Radar pulse detected hollow space beneath central glacier. Logging elevation. Beginning low frequency ambient scan. Signal spike every 31 seconds. Could be fluid movement. Geometric order suggests ancient volcanic process. No active heat source. Rover entry ramp activated. Airlock ready. Samples logged. Cycle complete. Outer shell is silica based. Density unusually consistent. Carbon levels within normal range. Life support green across zones. Descent speed 0.6 meters per sec. Scan field initialized. Ice density stable. Echo return clean. Depth 17 meters. No biofilm. Surface sterilized. Confirming full decontamination. Target trench up ahead. Core collector deployed. Wind negligible. We're past 1.5 meters. No deviation. Viscosity normal. No thermal output. These look geological, but very precise. Layering confirms slow movement. No thermal flow active now. Mission time, 10 hours, 12 minutes. Returning to base. Docking procedure initiated. 
Sample stable. Entering airlock path now. Case sealed. Internal temp at one degree Celsius. Biocontainment lock verified. Internal pressure match achieved. Proceeding to habitat deck. Trace carbonate structure found. No active organics detected. Atmospheric pressure drop 0.8%, visibility at 22 meters, holding all movement. Coordinates received. Next route plotted, 41 kilometers range. Orientation 14 degrees offset. Output reading 2.7 kilowatts. Depth scan returned clean. No motion within target bands. Freud probe reactive. Mission day 12. All targets met. Secondary scans queued for next solar window. Vehicle temp stabilized. Oxygen reserve charged. Begin ignition sequence. Telemetry clear. Estimated arrival in 3 hours, 12 minutes. Minor magnetic interference. No navigational drift. Continuing forward. Visual confirmation of target basin. Marking boundary. Deploying drone for mapping pass. Resolution set. Imaging in UV, IR, and standard visual channels. Footfall stable, no sink or slide. Beginning percussive test for void layers. Shallow void detected at 6.3 meters. Confirmed cavity, but no movement inside. Redirecting rover path 140 meters east. Sample secured. Tag number 442BO313 logged. Returning to base, cabin oxygen normal, sample stored in stasis bay.